Welcome to Decentralized News. So there are reports that crypto regulation in Paraguay is halfway um, to being completed uh, after Congress approved a bill. So they're looking to fully legalize cryptocurrencies um, and uh, Paraguay is uh, looking like it will be the next country on the list to accept cryptocurrencies legal tender. Uh, but that might not be on the cards yet, uh, but um, obviously this means they are inching closer uh, after this draft bill on uh, mining and trading crypto was uh, put through to Congress. So the Chamber of uh, Deputies did vote uh, by a 40 to 12 margin in favor of the law, which the Senate first introduced in uh, July of 2021. It aims to regulate crypto-related commercial activities, including trading crypto, custody and administration, mining of uh, cryptocurrencies. So the Ministry of uh, Industry and Commerce is supposed to coordinate and uh, supervise uh, those activities in coordination with the National Securities Commission, the Secretariat uh, for the Prevention of uh, Money and Asset Laundering, and uh, the National Electri uh, Electricity Administration, and also the Ministry of Finance. So after its uh, first uh, or initial introduction into the Senate, Congress did amend uh, and uh, passed the draft, which will now have to be approved by the Senate before the president can sign it into law. Its approval would establish Paraguay as a mining hub, as a country already boasts uh, some of the lowest electricity costs in uh, Latin America, at five cents, uh, five cents per kilowatt hour, crypto service uh, providers and miners would obtain a five-year license from the MIC as uh, mining becomes officially recognized in the country. But uh, not everybody is a crypto bull in Paraguay. Um, even though the Senate's initial proposal bills uh, makes its uh, pro approval likely, crypto has some uh, very strong opponents as well. Um, there is the BCP, which commented in March that the benefits of regulating digital assets would not necessarily outweigh the downsides, such as electricity consumption, loss of reputation and uh, cost for the financial system, which would be significant. Significant, sorry. So the BCP further noted that cryptocurrencies are high risk investments and they would give uh, investors a false sense of security. Uh, there's also um, Deputy Nunes, who was quoted saying that uh, crypto favors organized crime and uh, some other politicians as well will argue that the job creation from crypto mining did not outweigh the uh, increase in energy consumption from the activities. According to Statista, uh, half of Paraguay fintech companies enabled digital payments for businesses and consumers in 2022. And uh, this is uh, meant to continue to rise. So let's see what happens in uh, uh, Paraguay as far as uh, this uh, crypto regulation coming to fruition and the legalization of uh, cryptocurrencies in the country. Let me know if you are from that part of the world and uh, what your thoughts are on these developments. Don't forget to check out the links in the description. Check out our Discord and our Telegram server. Also like, share and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. We'll see you again in the next video. Peace.